Alright, what's up my boys? Welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies. Uh, last time we finally completed the adventure mode to the game, so now we are moving on to the extra modes of this game, which are the minigames, puzzle, and survival, and we're going to be starting off with the minigames. Um, so as you can see, there's only three minigames popping up right here, but as we complete more and more, um, more minigames will unlock, and in total there's 20 minigames. So uh, yeah, I don't know how many uh, minigames I'm going to be doing per video, but I'm going to try doing... I'll finish these three, and I'll see how long the video is. And after that, we'll decide on how many minigames we'll do per video. So uh, yeah, let's start with Zombotany. So the gimmick with Zombotany is that the zombies are essentially plants. So we have pea shooter zombies and walnut zombies. It's not the toughest uh, minigame in the game, but it's not the easiest either. So I'm going to bring potato mine. Uh, walnut is pretty essential and squash is pretty good. Um, actually, you know what? I'll bring repeater instead of pea shooter. Um, okay, we can bring torchwood, I guess. If I can set those up. And I'll bring cherry bomb and jalapeno. Um, this is the first zomb Zombotany. Um, there is a second Zombotany minigame, which is a little more difficult than this. Or This shouldn't be too difficult to complete. Um, I'm pretty sure we unlocked these first three minigames in the third world, which were the pool levels. Okay, so the thing that's really good about Potato Mine is that it can pretty much avoid all those uh, pea shooter zombies peas, which is a really great gimmick about... Uh, potato mine. So yeah, we want to get these sunflowers all set up. We want to make sure our shit doesn't get fucking shot down by the pea shooter zombies. If I were to plant like a repeater or a sunflower in this lane, in the middle lane, it would get shot down by the repeater. So that, that's why I brought walnut too. Walnut is pretty much essential in this um, minigame. Pretty much any wall plant is uh, gonna do really well. Oh shit, hold on. I wish I had something other than a little more protection than just... Oh shit, okay, this is bad. Um, okay, we'll protect those. Oh, I killed one of my sunflowers, God damn it. Uh, we need to get these walnuts up ASAP. I'm gonna actually use a sunflower there to protect shit. Okay, this is actually kind of tough. This is not the typical strategy I use. The strategy I would use is that I would put all my sunflowers in the top row. That would make it easier to protect all my sunflowers because they're all coming from one row. I'll start putting sunflowers down to add a little extra protection from where I don't have any walnuts. Yeah, I don't know why I brought torchwood because <laughs> uh, it's not that useful to me right now. Okay, so there's only two flags. It's not too difficult. You're gonna need to take those uh, walnut zombies down. Those walnut zombies are pretty tough. Damn, they sent two of those walnut zombies in one lane. Should I use a jalapeno? No, I'll save that. I'll save that. Okay, I think we should be fine now. I'm pretty much sacrificing sunflowers, but that's fine. Yeah, so this level isn't too difficult. It's mainly the second zombotany level that is a lot more difficult. Because that's when you start getting, um, like what, gatling peas as uh, zombies. And yeah, that can be really annoying. And there's also like a jalapeno zombie, a tall nut zombie. Yeah, it gets pretty tough later on, but we'll get through all the mini games, no matter how tough they are. Uh, I could probably replace some of these sunflowers right here. There we go. Should be the last zombie of this wave, and then we'll get the final wave. All right, this setup looks kind of weird, but we'll just roll with it. There we go, gun them down. Gun them down, boys. God damn, they're taking them out fast. Look at that. Yeah, pea shooters and walnuts. Or I guess I should say repeaters and walnuts. Great combo for this level. Take that guy down. I probably could just blow him up. There we go. There we go. You got the trophy. You get a trophy for the first time you complete a minigame. And that grants you a diamond, which is uh, really good. Afterwards, if you re replay a completed minigame that you already have a trophy in, it just gives you 250 coins. So uh, yeah, so next is Walnut Bowling. This isn't anything new to us. This was the first minigame in the first world. Um, this is a little more difficult than um, the one in the first the first world. I, ugh, I can't speak right now. <laughs> so uh, yeah, as you can see, there's a bucket head. I don't think we had bucket heads last time. Um, is there any more? Just gonna throw that. Do -do 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 -do. Take him out. Get him. 
Aww. Oh, I'm just like waiting for more zombies to pop up, but it's kind of slow right now. Oh, newspaper zombies. You can actually kind of use the newspaper zombies to your advantage. Like he can move, he can run up a bit, he can run faster than other zombies and then try to use him for a combo. Ah, uh, bounce down. What a shame. But yeah, you can like chain combos in this. Which is really cool. They're giving me a lot of walnuts, holy shit. Can this like bounce down? They're like a in a really awkward spot. Bounce up. Nice. This doesn't feel too interesting right now, <laughs> to be honest. Bruh. Take it- oh my god, it really went through the gap. Take him out! Ah, oh, so close. Oh yeah, these pole vaulters can get kind of annoying because they can jump over your walnuts. Let me just have them jump. There we go. Get one of them. Nice. Oh! Oh, nice. Got a third zombie there. Here we go. There's a lot more zombies now. I need to start chaining these. Nuts! Ha! <laughs> and it gives you more and more coins the longer your combo goes. Bounce up. Nice. Nice. I'm gonna let this guy run up a bit. Oh, come on. Yeah, so some of this is, is kind of RNG. It kind of just depends on how the walnut bounces. Sometimes you can get really lucky, and sometimes the game just doesn't want to be nice. Wow, I have a lot of these red walnuts. Oh, that's a gold mine right there. Oh, well, they're not giving me a lot of regular walnuts now. <laughs> it's probably because I'm just fucking spamming the fuck out of them. Okay, we're gonna do that. Get rid of those guys. We're getting a little close. I think we're doing pretty well so far. No. Oh wow, really? This all kind of like depends on the speed of the walnut when it bounces. It's really weird. Holy shit, there's actually a lot of them. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, how are we gonna manage this? Holy shit, this isn't even the last wave. Okay. It's fine, don't panic, don't panic. We're still good. Okay, it's only giving me explosive nuts. That sounds kind of weird. Holy shit. Ugh! Okay, how the fuck? Okay, um, holy shit. I want to do this without using any lawnmowers. Oh, come on, what does that bounce? There we go. Okay, I'll take out the guy with the bucket head. Okay. There we go. That works, that works. I feel like I could have played that better, but that's fine. Yeah, I think I'll do one more minigame, which is Slot Machine. Uh, this one's a pretty simple minigame. Um, there's no, like, waves for this. You have, like, a goal right here, um, 2000 Sun. This is heavily RNG-based, and when I say RNG-based, it's all RNG. It's a fucking slot machine, so... <laughs> there's really no skill to this. Uh, it costs 25 Sun to spin the, the slot machine. I almost said spin the wheel. Um, pretty much the strat for this is to just um, play the slot machine until you get like enough sunflowers and plants to be able to fend off the zombies. And then at some point you just stop spending your sun when you have like a, a good economy going. Yeah, we're getting decent RNG right now. Uh, we got three plants. I could use another plant. Okay, that works. If you don't complete the level in time, uh, you will eventually get overwhelmed by the zombies. Like they end up Sending in a shitload. It's kind of a race against time too, so... You know, you wanna... Try to complete the level as fast as you can. Although, as long as you play it smart. Like, placing your plants in the right places. And, you know, spending your sun well. It's really not that hard of a minigame. Still haven't gotten any sunflowers yet. It's kind of unfortunate. Oh yeah, you can also get diamonds and sun from the slot machine too. Which is really cool. Oh my god, yeah, we can get three of a kind here, so... Yeah, we can get a shit little walnuts there. That's good. I think it's two of a kind gets you one plant and three of a kind gets you three. Yeah, two of a kind. Okay, I see. Holy shit, we got a jackpot. Let's go. Hey, I'm fine with getting a sun. That'll get us to the end of the level quicker. Do, 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 do. There we go, our first sunflower. Sunflowers are pretty helpful. Yeah, they are sending in bucket heads now, so we need to watch out for that. There we go, another sunflower. This video is probably gonna be pretty short since I'm only playing three minigames. Holy shit, they give us more walnuts. God, this shit about to look like Wall Maria from Attack on Titan. Actually, which wall is the outer wall in Attack on Titan? I don't remember because I've only seen like 12 episodes from Attack on Titan. Here you go, triple walnuts. <laughs> three times the protection. All right, we're, I guess we're doing triple walnuts everywhere. I could honestly just wait until we get to 2000 sun. But like, why stop, you know? <laughs> We're getting pretty lucky. It's not like you can get 
unlucky with this. Well, I mean, you can. You, you could just get nothing, but uh, I really could use more sunflowers. <laughs> Holy shit. I know I said the zombies do overwhelm you at some point, but I don't see us getting overwhelmed with this kind of setup. <laughs> This is such a stupid setup. Man, this is taking a lot longer than usual. Again, it is all luck based. They haven't gi they've only given us two sunflowers. What the hell? Oh my god, he <laughs> keep giving us walnuts. <laughs> oh my god. I'm just waiting for like another jackpot or like something, like three of a kind sunflowers or something. Just so I can end this level already. <laughs> oh my god, stop giving me walnuts. <laughs> I got four walnuts in one row. <laughs> oh my god, this really is looking like Attack on Titan. Or I guess I should say Attack on Zombie. Yes! We got more sun. That was only two of a kind though. Alright. Oh, finally! Another sunflower. Jeez. Alright, we got three sunflowers now. Oh yes, now they're giving us sunflowers. Here we go. Oh, now we're, now we're getting sun. Alright, we're getting close to the end. Almost there. Come on, just 75 more sun. There it is, there it is. Bang, we got it. So we completed Zombotany, Walnut Bowling, and Slot Machine. So I guess, yeah, I've been recording for 31 minutes. I think that's fine if we do three mini games per video. So yeah, next we'll do It's Raining Seeds, Begold, and Invisigal. Which, honestly, I don't really enjoy these mini games, but, you know, we gotta get through them at some point, so yeah. Thank you for watching, and I'll see y'all later. God, it's so refreshing to only have to do a 31-minute video. <laughs> These one-hour videos are killing me on the editing.